International Boxing News, I'm here with Sonny Liston Ali, still the best name in boxing, I maintain, it, here at the O2. Uh, Sonny, you got, according to BoxRec, two fights coming up in quick succession. Is BoxRec correct? I don't think so. I don't think I will, not that I know of anyway, God knows. Uh -huh. what, what is your next fight date? This is my next fight date, uh, 26th of November, so, O2 uh, Arena, where we are now. Wow. Got an, it's crazy, got, isn't it? Have you got an opponent lined up? Um, I'm not sure who they've got me lined up with. To be honest with you, I don't really, I don't really like deep it too much about the opponents and that. Like, I let my coach do the um, do the research, let him figure out the game plan and that. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I don't think I don't think game plans work anyway. By the time you go in there, it all goes out the window anyway, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. So um, yeah, I end up switching up about three different styles in there anyway. You know what it's like. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, that's the next one, 26th of November. Get your tickets on my Instagram. <laughs> Yeah, get on to Sonny's Instagram and get those tickets. Um, let's, let's support our upcoming pros. Do, do you know uh, how many rounds this fight's going over? Uh, it's another six rounder. Okay, yeah. so still in the yeah. learning phase then. Solid six rounds, yeah, do you know what I mean? Like, I mean, all my fights have gone distance so far. I haven't lost a round so far, so I'm hoping to keep that up, do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. If I can get an early knockout, I'll get an early knockout. But one thing I'm not going to do is look for it, because that last fight, I sort of went in there trying like, I didn't, I didn't do nothing bad, I don't think. I felt I still looked good, but I was I was trying too hard to get the knockout. I was trying like big shots all the time. Um, this time I'm going to say stay composed and just, yeah, hopefully it will come to one bang. That's it. Yeah, a couple of my colleagues did actually say, uh, watching it ringside, that, well, actually, Sonny can hit. Yeah, just from yeah. the sound test, at yeah. least. But you were looking for it. I was looking for it too it much. Happened. Yeah, that's, that's the point. It never comes, doesn't it, when you look for it. Yeah, it's interesting you said there that you don't think it's worth having a single fight plan. Does that mean at this stage you're still trying to develop your ring IQ so that Of you course, can like you it? say, I've only had four fights, so I'm still trying to find myself in the game, um, it's still early doors, so so yeah, literally just trying to find out what my style actually is. Um, and yeah, it's only gonna develop and it's only gonna get better, so just keep ticking over and hopefully the best, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I often say this to fighters that the most important thing at the top level is the ring IQ. Mm -hmm. In this game, there's loads of guys who can hit. That's the thing you got. You you got to be able to switch up in there. You can't go in there one game plan because if that goes down, then what you're going to start panicking and you're going to start making silly mistakes. So I just take it as it comes. You know what I mean? Take it round by round. Whatever he's doing, whatever I do, listen. I, I, I can mix it up. Do you know what I mean? I can do a bit of everything. So as long as you can do that, that's that's, that's what's going to take you to the top. I think. Mm -hmm. What what sort of guys you got uh, in sparring uh, for this camp? Uh, obviously, Ohara Davis is in my in my camp, as you know. Um, he's fighting. I'm not going to say when he's fighting actually, but he's fighting soon. Um, big big fight. So obviously, I've got rounds of him. Um, I've got Cameron Briggs up my gym as well. Very good fight. I up, up and coming. Um, Bilal Bilal um, Bilal Ali. Obviously, you see him on that last show. Really mm -hmm. good fighter. Uh, Jordan Perkins down there, obviously not for me sparring, but Jordan Perkins down there. Down our gym alone, we've got enough sparring, do you know what I mean? But then we still go out there, um, like you say, I've sparred them all. I've sparred the Connor Benz, I've sparred Robbie Davis Jr. I've been in more, um, one of my friends, SK, comes down, um, SK Showstopper, I don't know if you heard of him. Yeah. He comes down, done a good few rounds of him, he's another another big talent. So, uh, yeah, the sparring's there, yeah, the sparring's there. You were a, a key sparring partner for Martin McDonough, I know, for his yep. recent successful yep. Southern Area title fight. Because you're, you're another tall, gangly guy yeah, like that's it, Martin. So gangly. You, yeah. <laughs> Listen, Tommy Hearns was tall and that's gangly. It, Nothing yeah, wrong suppose, with him. I suppose, I suppose. <laughs> Let you off. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, I know you said you don't look too far ahead. Your coach is, has one eye ahead. Uh, I yep. spoke to Will last time I was down at the gym. He was saying uh, maybe next year he's going to look at Dennis Denikoyev, the Southern Area champ. Super lightweight. Yeah, super yeah. Lightweight. I mean, right now we're still we're at a right point now in this in this camp as well. I'm going to go into this fight a bit heavier than what I usually fight at. So I'm, I'm going to test that because I think either I can I can make super lightweight. I can make, I make it pretty easy, but um, I just want to test this fight out, see see the strength difference. Like you said, I know I can punch hard anyway, but I want to like. I want to test this one. It's only a, do you know what I mean? Like we can always go back to super lightweight anyway. But this one I'm fighting at Welter, well, so um, we'll see how this one goes, and then we'll, we'll decide from this one whether to go back down to um, super light or not. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that, that is a, another potential fight. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, as you said, uh, you're still on six rounders, so mm -hmm. you don't want to think too far ahead. Um, but if you do stay at super lightweight, 
I mean, what a division. I mean, the one of the other the lads. Minute, yeah, it's crazy. On the same card, the Irishman, yeah, <laughs> Piers yeah, O'Leary. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, yeah. <laughs> that's what I'm saying, bro. The way, the, this way, this way, uh, super lightweight is everyone's. It's, if we're talking just London alone, do you know what I mean? Like, the fighters around this way is crazy. Mm -hmm. But hopefully that's where the money's at, though, do you know what I mean? Yeah, exa exactly. Um, and if you do move up to welterweight, no easier route there either. That's it, of course, it's traditionally of course, such yeah. a such course, a hard yeah. division. Um, trying to think, have, have you been on such a big uh, occasion? Uh, like well, this to be fair, be? Look, every, everywhere I fought, so my foot, my debut was at your call. Um, I think that's that's the smallest venue I've fought at so far. I've done Copper Box Arena. Um, I've done Wembley OVO Arena. This is definitely the biggest by far. Like this is this is crazy. I like coming here. I've never been here before. So I've come here today, looked around, and I'm like, oh, it just blew my mind up a little bit. But uh, yeah, just, listen, I'm going to take it in and suck it up and uh, enjoy it. That's the main thing, do you know what I mean? I'm not going to think too much into oh, it's a big venue, start getting scared and that, because listen, it is where it is. It doesn't matter where I'm for, I can find a garden. Mm -hmm. you know what I mean, it's all the same. You go in there to do one job, you ain't got to worry about where it is. So uh, yeah, I'm trying not to think too much about where it is. Still, uh, good to get that experience in front yeah, of such a big crowd because uh, we've seen some good good fighters freeze on the big stage yeah so it's not going to be up. me you ain't going to worry about that <laughs> is that because you like a crowd <laughs> well listen the crowd the crowd does play a big part in it but you, you just don't you don't, don't take too much in from the crowd do you? like obviously I know some people get carried away with the crowd and end up making silly mistakes because the crowd's going nuts mm -hmm. I don't really like the crowd's just there sort of thing obviously I love having my crowd there I love my supporters um, and obviously yeah, I love the noise I, 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 yeah it's part of it but um you can't think too much into the crowd. Sure, absolutely. So, uh, how do you assess the domestic scene? Um, have you got any particular fighters in mind, or I don't get the impression you're someone who has Listen, like, with anyone? Yeah, like I say, I'm just I, I take it as it comes. You know what I mean? Whoever they put in front of me, I'm going in there to do the mission. I'm going to go in and do what I've got to do. Do you know what I mean? So, whoever whoever they put in front of me, you'll get get the same job. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. All right, well, uh, exciting for you to be in such a big uh, arena uh, for the yeah, first time. Um, yeah, still at the learning stage, but a good way to end the year. That's it, exactly that, exactly that. Just before Christmas, man, you can't, you can't go wrong, can you? Uh -huh. Bang on. Don't put on too much weight over Christmas. <laughs> uh, you might have uh, <laughs> nah, some nah, fights I'm, early I'm, next year. I'm not, really like, I'm not really one to blow up on that too much. Mm -hmm. Not like one of my friends, not going to mention his name. He knows who he is. <laughs> so uh, O'Hara doesn't invite you to Five Guys then? Not at a minute, nah. Not at a minute. All right, yeah. T probably turn those invites down. Yeah. <laughs> he ain't going five guys at the minute, anyway, I shouldn't think. No, I hope not. Not with that big fight. If it, if it is what I think it is it, yeah. uh, coming up. All right, Sonny. Uh, absolute pleasure ca catching up with you as usual. Um, yeah. Good luck Saturday night, and Top uh, man. yeah, we'll speak to you fight night. Top man. Thank you very much. Cheers, mate.